morning everybody and good morning ladies just getting them out of the paddock here and it's just gone 20 past five so it's about 45 minutes to an hour to the couch from here and these girls are well on their way yeah just an essentials day today there's not too much more planned um put the cows feed the calves feed the calves their pellets lock the cows away because the cows are out in the swamp today so out there and um yeah it's pretty much today that's about it of course a b up at the runoff and a b here so that's about it it's just a nice cruisy weekend day Along pretty well, we're just getting into the last straight here. It's just gone six o'clock, not too bad. I see Dad's already started milking. He'll have the first route before I get there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, good day. Hopefully, it doesn't look like the rain's rolling through yet. So, I thought it was a bit rain last night, but it looks like it's gonna rain for a little bit. So, we'll be going about uh, 40 minutes now. So, it'll be about 50. This last bit's always the longest. It will slow down from the last train. Made it. We made it. Body Dad! Oh, no. How are we doing? Good? No rain yet? No, it's good. Don't want rain. No, we don't want the rain. Pretty good. Periscope, where is he? Just pushing the cows up out there. Maybe he's going to start washing the yard. Hello! Hello! He's going to wash the yard, push the cows up. And we're going to keep milking here. We've got a nice slow one here, sort of cut for up early. Yeah, milking well. I still reckon they're going to crack the six today. We haven't had any rain roll through yet, but it's a coming. It's a coming. I hope it's all gone through and just got Dad's washing the yard out there, just finished washing the pit. And we're going here, just running the uh, hot water into the acid now. Get a full tub. Then we have to uh, make sure we fill up the hot water cylinder again. Because uh, we won't have enough to actually do a hot wash straight after, after we've done a wash in the morning. So we give it time to reheat. And then, um, yeah. Then we can wash it later this afternoon, the vat that is. Tank on his feet here about 10 to the yard. Ah, look, here's Tessa. <laughs> yes, we can see coming. Right, Dallas? Shall we go feed the carvies? We got the buckets for the carvies. <laughs> Mackenzie's little pet sluggy. She found it on the ground. Tessa's just going to give them more milk. We're going to go give them their pellets. Bucket of... I got right, Dallas, shall we go give them pellets? You too. Happy has <laughs> <laughs> Is there any bag there? Yep, my old car left one there. How many? We got pellets there? Are they? Oh, they need more. They need We've got more. It. Dallas, open it up and he's grabbing the bag. You need about three of those full, Dallas. That's the way. That'll be good. Into the yep, into the container. Oh, Carl, help you. Yep, that's the way. Mommy, this way. You if you want to play one of the games. A game? The game, the, the farm. Oh. Can I do? <laughs> no, no game. Oh, wrong way. Bye, bye. Oh, yeah. Right, all done. All Easy done. as. Got the meal, and they're happy. Whole bag of meal between the two today. It's really got the first one. Hey, wait for me. <laughs> Feed them. Oh, 
<laughs> right, and with that, Dan and myself, we're heading up the runoff to go and do some AB. We're going to leave Dallas, Mackenzie and Tessa here to go lock the cows away and give those calves their four bags of meal, eh? Yep. <laughs> Oh, yeah, we we oh, I see the mic oh. in the ground. She's going to it. Not even have to hold on. No hands. She. Kenzie's got it. Feel much much, Ken. Whichever way you want. Left or right. Yeah, you can go through there. Hi, Dallas. here, pick up the milk, I'm gonna grab the motorbike for Tessa and get her ready with her four bags on there. And uh, we've hooked up to the trailer to um, go pick up two bales of silage to get us through this weekend. There they go, off to go lock the cows away and feed some carvies. And we are off to go grab two bales of silage and go and AB some heifers. Good job, Mary. Yep, now I gotta flip this other one over. Just to get a book. Today, this is the foils. You just want to pet them? Hi. I thought they liked me. <laughs> That's 38. 38 boys like two hands. Yeah. Probably eating. No, I don't think so. None of them like you. You gotta let them come to you. Well, they're not used to you. a long time since we came and seen them. Maybe you got the wrong red panda. The other one's... This is him? Uh, are we ready? Or am I meeting you at the gate? You gonna meet me at the gate? You gotta watch the calves don't follow you. Okay. Go Dallas. Um, Cause there isn't. Don't stand on the back of it. You're so close. You're so close, Dallas. Ready? Big muscles. Good work. Right. Kenzie, your one. And as long as you're touching only the plastic, it doesn't give you a shock, okay? So you gotta watch the back of your arm. Alright. Yep. Reach. Good work. Thank you. Electric, yep. Hi, Carvies. Yep. 
Kizzy soon on the front. What? Where do I sit? There. Yeah. Are you sure? Okay. I'm driving. Again? Dallas didn't drive. Oh, oh, we've got a new window for that tractor. We've just got to go and uh, replace it. We've just got to find time to do it. As for now, let's go get the heifers. Go do some AB. Just uh, me and Dad today. Go fast enough. <laughs> Driving through here and there. One, there's one there, there's two, there's three. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Right, let's go get them sorted. And again, we'll take the ones that are um, got green on their backs. They're going up to Bondi's cattle. And come on, the other ones that are bully say will go up there. We'll go back in this paddock. We've got enough grass here. They come in here for like another two days, probably, with the amount that there are. The amount of uh, heifers there are. They'll probably be in here another two days, I reckon. She's a cracker of a little heifer. Andrew's got a good one there. Oh, there's one there. Another one there. That's good. I'm going to put the bales on it. Yep. Right. Yeah, I've see you. Already. Yeah, you already loaded them up. Hey, Bondi. Bondi. Loose fitting, Dad. Bit of a water leak here. Bondi. Yeah. Jeepers, they're sorting them out. Bondi's. I think that's it, isn't it? There's six. There's six there. Yeah. There's six there. Dad, you want to bring your friendly one? Five. Bring old Maggie up. We got one more. One more. That was quick. Andrew's onto it today. <laughs> right. Now it's just one more to come around and down there. One so far. Look, she's going back up the hill. Help. Help. Right, buddy, coming. Right, I'll take the motorbike. I'll go lock these ones in the new paddock and go let the others through. That's the story. Yep, got to let this one here. There's only two today. Oh, no, he's ugly, but that, no. <laughs> There's only two today. Very strange. <laughs> yeah. Good girls. Well, they go back up the hill. There's only 40 uh, be into the 30s now left. Because the ones up the top here are getting a change of paddock today. So I've already opened the gate where they're going. And uh, it should be pretty easy. Take these to that open gate. Let the others through into the paddock. has got 70 and Andrew has got 25 so that's why we have quite a few more that's why we should have more a day but uh, the other day there was four and three were dads four for Andrew and three for dad so yeah it just well, it depends on who's on on the day all right let's get these girls up to their new paddock and let the others through the ones across the beds here uh, the paddock's still got a little bit of grass in it they probably would be all right for another day if there was no rain coming so We'll push these into that paddock up there and uh, let these others out. Come on, boy, how it done? Yeah. 
Here. Come on. Off you go. Come on. There's the big boy there. Crossbreed. And there's another boy there. The Jersey fella. So we don't keep the calves from uh, the crossbreed bull or the Jersey bull. But um, we just really send those ones on the bobby lorry. Right, with that, I'll go check these fences. I'll see... There's anything to report on the fences, I'll show you, but other than that, we'll wait for these girls to come out and uh, go make sure everyone's out of the paddock and the fences are good. They'll be happy in that paddock a few days. It's quite a big paddock. Probably be close to three hectares, that paddock, because it goes up and over the hill, and there's quite a bit of the paddock is on the other side of that hill too. So, um, yeah, right. I'll be right there for a few days. Go check this paddock. So the fence is all right. Just checking the trough here. As you see, it's leaking. It's an old fitting. So that whole fitting needs replacing. No need to worry about. It is all uh, free water anyway. It's from that can, the little stream that comes from up the valley there and comes down. So I'll tell Dad. But we'll probably look at fixing that sometime next week when we come up for silage next time, probably. But uh, that's for the week. We should be all right that, let's go lock the other girls away. They're happy in their paddock up there. They've managed to get back to watch them do two cows. Oh, with that, let's go lock these girls away. Yeah. That's a Monday job again when we're back to go pick up some silage. But until then, we'll uh, go and put these girls away. Come on, up up. It's only a small leak there too. It's not a big leak. Come on. Oh, you got it? Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, great hands onto it. Ah, uh, we'll head off. We've got the two bales taken off. So we'll just drop the bales and then that's us for today. We'll see you all at uh, milking tonight. Drop the bales around there. Just here will do nicely. And with that, I'll see you all at booking tonight. So it's just gone three o'clock and Dad's just left to go get the cows in. They are pretty fair way down tonight. He's usually been leaving about quarter past, so. A little 15 minutes early. We've got our bale of silage there and we have got sent our milk solids here. How many litres do we send? 58.15. And our smack sow count has been going up over the last few days. Been keeping an eye out for our mastitis cow. Haven't found it yet. Smack sow count 52,000, 66,000, 71,000, 80,000. And the 12th of October was 90,000. I had a look at what it was to, uh, yesterday's on the uh, 13th. And that was 72, so. She may have solved herself. We haven't actually been able to find any cows with mastitis. Not being showing any signs, so. <coughs> right. Before we load up this bale of silage, actually. Better go wash the vat. The vat is, uh, needs a washing. Just a hot acid today, followed by a cold rinse cycle. Ready to go. We better get into the cow shed because here they come. All right, let's get to milking. So we already got, uh, already have on our list two, four, six animals, for six cows that'll be bulling, be put up tonight. It's going to be interesting to see how many more we get today. The heifers only had two, so brings the grand total for today up to definitely eight. That's all ready. Stir is on. Only leaves one that we know of. Come on. 
Pop my jump. Probably. Yeah. Chains up down there. That's it. Seepers, that was our. Uh, Dad knows what he's doing. <laughs> so that's six done. One to go that we know of. They all rubbed well. Probably the uh, big old girl there's probably the most least rubbed, but she's definitely been rubbed. Just finishing up milking here, just doing the wash up. Looks like we've got one bull correct out there. One bull in calculus. And yeah, uh, Gordon's here. Perfect time. Jesus, the neighbor's still milking, he's usually done by now. He could be doing afternoon AB as well. Not too sure. Right, here we go, here's our seven. And here they come. Right, let's get to it. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Where'd you come? Where'd you come? Come on. Hello. Come on. Hello. Come on, friendly clogs. Come on, time to get a little car they put in you. Pulling quite well, she's been rubbed, see? Usually a lot easier to see when two cows side by side that uh, one's rubbed and one's not. Come on. Successful. All done and dust. It's another seven. Uh, finished the wash up, all sorted. Got my little passenger here. We got the bale of silage on board. Let's go find these cows and give them a nice bale of silage. They're in the furthest paddock on the farm from the cow shed. And, uh, yeah, tough. Um, Yes, it's, uh, it's going to be a good little drive in the morning, so leave nice and early and uh, get this bale feed out. And with that, that's us for tonight. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the morning. And of course, go the All Blacks. Big game in the morning versus the Irish. Thanks to all the Irish people wishing the All Blacks good luck too. <laughs> going to be a cracker of a game. Go the All Blacks. Good luck to the Irish. Got a hard team to face there. See you all in the morning.